general message for June 8th through June the 14th. Let's get right into your love bird bonus. And remember, check the playlist for your general love message for the month. Angels and guides, angels and guides, we're spot, we're doing a spot check for your romantic love life. Positive energy for Aries. Just a spot check for the week. Angels and guides, angels and guides, positive energy for I think that's it. I think that is it. Yes, yes, yes. For Aries. Seven little days. Oh, hold on, Aries. Hold on, Aries and Aries. Aries cross watcher. Okay. Aries, Aries, Aries. Love life. Love life. What? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Angels. How beautiful is this? Okay. So in your beautiful, beautiful romantic love bonds, we have Rainbow Reviver and Practice. After a while, your dance on air practice makes perfect. You're almost there. Oh my gosh. So I definitely feel like you've been doing a lot of work bringing your breathing life back into this romantic relationship. And guess what? I feel it's paying off. Yes, yes, yes. It's definitely paying off. Okay, so singles, Aries, singles. Love energy around the singles. Positive energy, positive energy, angels. What is going on? Yes, yes, yes. For, thank you, thank you, thank you. For singles, single, single, singles, we have distorted masculine and self-respect. Do I need to say more singles? Yes, this is a time to, I feel like it's, be careful who you mingle your energy with this week. Show self-respect. Okay, all right, all right. Don't let your, your values down. Please don't lower your standards. Not this week. No, 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 Aries. Okay, so let's get right into the general message for Aries for seven little days. Angels and guides, angels and guides, June 8th through June 14th, we're looking for positive energy for Aries. What is going on for Aries? Seven little days, that is it. Just seven little days. Positive energy, angels, positive energy. What is going on for Aries? Seven little, seven little days <laughs> for Aries. Positive energy, please, positive energy. Thank you, thank you. Oh, thank you. Thank you, angels. What is going on with, with Aries? Seven little days, that is it. That is it. That is it. All right, moving on to the angels deck. Positive energy, please, for Aries. Angels and guides, we're looking for some love. Looking for some love for Aries. Positive energy. Looking for some positive energy. Angels, what's going on? What are the energies around Aries? Moving on to Yes, 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 my mama's deck, of course. You guys knew that was coming. You knew it was coming. Angels and guides, positive energy for Aries, seven little days. That is it, just seven, seven little days. Positive energy, please, angels. Seven days for Aries. Okay, now we're going to top it off, of course. You know what? I feel like we need to add the old angels. I'm getting this feeling that we need to add the old angels deck in here. Yes, yes, yes. Bringing it back. Bringing it back. Yes, yes, yes. Yes. I think Mercury's about to go direct or something like that. Angels and guides, angels and guides, positive energy for thank you, thank you, thank you for Aries for seven little days. And we're obviously going to always top it off with the Hummingbird deck. Positive energy, please. Positive energy for the hummingbird deck. Yes, yes, and yes. Bum, 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 bum. Just a little bit more, just a little bit more. And two more. There's one. Thank you, thank you, thank you. One more, angels. Just thank you. Thank you. I so appreciate that. Okay, now. We're going to tidy up a bit here. Yes, we are, Aries. 
and then we're going to get right into your messages for seven seven little days <laughs> okay so you're like that's two seven little days <laughs> okay so angels and guys we're looking for positive energy what are the messages what is the major theme for the week is the king of swords reversed with awareness yes 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 counselor seven of hearts king of clubs angel of sweet shyness three of hearts and the seven of spades lots and lots going on i definitely feel like this week is a week to let down your guard. I definitely feel let down your guard with the awareness. I feel like there's messages that need to come in. And if you're not showing your sensitivity, you may miss them. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, the counselor. I definitely feel like this is a time to reach out, to reach out, to reach out because seven of hearts, you're feeling a little hurt. You're feeling, um, uh, not supported, if you will. You thought someone was there for you. You thought someone had your back. Maybe it was a friend. Maybe it was a family member. Maybe it was a love interest. And you're feeling a little bit hurt about it. But I see you're able. I see you're able with the King of Clubs. I see you're able to become non-attached in this situation. With the Angel of Sweet Shyness, you're not even making a big deal about it. The Three of Hearts is telling me that um, I feel like... I feel like this Three of Hearts is... There's a few people around you, and it's almost like, you know, this person over here might make you upset or you don't feel like they have your back. But that person does, but that person does. With the seven of spades, I definitely feel there's a, a bit of, there's a lot of non-attachment. There's a lot of, okay, this one did this, and it could be a person, it could be a romantic, two romantic partners, or it could be your children, or it could be your friends, or it could be a job, whatever it is you're feeling, if this doesn't work out, if this doesn't support me, it's okay, I have options, and you're okay with that, it's, you're not even upset about it, you're like, okay, all right, 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 okay, so let's look at the recent past areas. You had the king of wands, I'm sorry, the knight of wands, discontent and boredom, leadership, yes, 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 four of spades, king of hearts, angel of sisterhood, four of spades, and the six of clubs. So I feel like in the recent past, someone... I feel like someone, something energetically left your life in the recent past, right? And you didn't even care. You were just like, okay, it could have been a job. It could have been a relationship. It could have been a person. It could have been a living situation, but okay, it's okay. I hear you said, all right, fine. It's, it's over. I feel like this gave you the opportunity to do for yourself, the leadership. It got, it gave you a lot of security in your life, took your power back. It gave you your power back. The angel of sisterhood. I see you reaching out to friends, sisters, brothers. Yes. And that gave you support and you spoke your truth about whomever, whatever that was that left your life. Now, when we look, when we look in the middle of the week, we have the Ace of Wands, emotional withdrawal, take your power back. Whoa, the Joker, Nine of Clubs, Angel of Serenity, Ace of Hearts, and the Six of Diamonds. So I definitely feel in the middle of the week, it's there is there's a new beginning, and this is a, I feel like this is, is, you're not thinking about a new beginning. This is something you've been thinking about, and you're taking action on now, right? Emotional withdrawal. I feel like whatever it is, you're, de you're detaching from other things to start this new thing, right? And, the, and the, take your power back, and whatever it is that you are starting, it is giving you power. With the Joker, you don't know what to expect. Neither does anyone else. They don't know what to expect with this new energy, new thing that you're beginning. The Nine of Clubs, I hear you talking. I hear you, yes, I hear you talking a lot. With the Angel of Serenity, it's giving you peace. This new beginning is you. It's about you, and it's about your finances. It's about your values. And I see whatever they are, it's long term. You're not changing it. You're definitely not changing it. So whatever you're starting this week, whatever action, it's not a thought, it's an action. Whatever new thing you're beginning this week, you know, it's giving you power. And I, I feel like I hear you talking about it. I hear you telling people about it. I, I definitely, 
this is a good thing for you. This is definitely a good thing for you because it's bringing you peace, okay? All right, now, when we look at the end of the week, we have the four of pentacles reversed with the power card, the all is well card, the queen of hearts, the jack of hearts, the angel of rescue, the two of clubs, and the five of spades. So I definitely feel at the end of the month, with the four of pentacles reversed, I see you releasing. Um, I see you releasing something of value this week. It could be you're releasing money. It could be re you're releasing something that you valued. You are letting out into the universe. It could have been something that you've been saving for a long time, and now you're ready to release it, right? And it's what whatever this release is. You might even be spending money this week. Okay, you're ready, but it's money that you have to spend. With the power card, this is definitely giving you power. You know that you you are in a good place you're definitely knowing that with the queen of hearts you are up in your feelings about this and it does feel like a sacrifice maybe for children maybe for someone younger than you maybe for someone that needs you right with the the angel of rescue you are there for them yes you are definitely there for them i see with the two of clubs you may be talking to one other person about this with the two of clubs or but remember with this two of clubs sometimes it turns into a little bit of a heated discussion be mindful of that make sure that it's you know it's that let's agree to disagree things of that nature with the vibe of space i definitely see you changing traveling and moving moving body moving places maybe moving jobs maybe just moving period now when we look at your bonus we have the two of pentacles the heart chakra outdoors yes 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 ten of diamonds three of clubs angel of sweet delight king of clubs and the four of spades four parts all right so i definitely see there's there's um a decision that needs to be made about finances this week and I feel like this decision is it's heartfelt it's it's like this is really it really has your heart it's touched your heart this um this decision of finances the decision of what you need to do in and I, I feel like you're a bit why do I feel like you're a bit detached from it it's like not close to you this decision and it's and it's the ten of diamonds there's you have the resources to to whatever this is you definitely have the resources, so don't worry. It's almost like with the angel of sweet delight, you you're not worrying about this. The king of hearts, you're having, you're grounded. You're you you know that this is the right thing to do. And with the four of hearts, it's almost like all that ends well is well, right? With the um, so the decision that you're making. It's like you have to make up your mind about this. This has something to do with your heart. Whatever this decision is, it could be with family. It could be something that's tr deeply concerning. Um, it's touched your heart. Things of that nature. But that's the decision that has to be made. I feel like this decision, it says outdoors. So maybe the decision has to do with outdoors. But I kind of feel like it, it's, it's like distance from you, right? But you have the resources to do it. You haven't made up your mind, but you have the resources to do it. With the three of clubs, I see there is some worry. The angel of sweet delight, you're going to let that worry go. You're going to get grounded. You know the right thing to do. You hear it from your guides. And with the four of hearts, emotionally, you will feel like, you know what? I'm grounded. I'm making the right decision. You are making the right decision based on truth, based on your values. So... Go forth and go ahead. I send you joy, namaste, and much, much love sent your way.